let's analyze what Solana is doing now that Bitcoin is at all time high. We'll go back to this chart from Solana, but first let's have a look at Bitcoin. So this is the weekly Bitcoin chart. We see three changes in trend line that are critical that everybody learns how to read. The first one is from the base of the previous cycle to the base of the current cycle. So this is the slow slope here. Then we had the low of the bear market with a retest around the MA50 on the weekly chart. This is the second trend line. Acceleration once we confirm the bottom in the bear market and now explosion in price. So this is now the trend line of the MA50 recently on the weekly for Bitcoin. So we are at an all-time high, no surprise there. For me, it's a little quicker than I'd expected, but here we are, $76,100. So that's a 113% year performance, 80% returns year to date. 25% in the last three to six months and 8% in the last week. So this is the massive asset that's leading the whole market. It's pulling everybody, but the dominance of Bitcoin at this stage is quite huge. Few altcoins are starting to move, but all the attention is on Bitcoin. So now, fast horses. Who's following Bitcoin? Who's getting near all-time highs and how quickly altcoins will get there? So this is the Solana weekly chart. We see that today we are breaking above this resistance level, which is critical, 200 US dollar per coin. The peak of the previous cycle is $260. So we are... 30%, approximately 30% away from all-time high. Only 30%. For now a top four coin by market cap, according to coin market cap, it just flipped BNB. But the activity on the chain is huge. Users are huge. The amount of fees, besides the fact that it's fractions of a cent, because there's millions of transactions, they are gathering a lot of fees. They're growing a lot quicker than anybody else. They're catching up Ethereum at an alarming rate. So I would not be surprised if Solana in this bull run either gets very close to the market cap of ETH or goes beyond it. The only thing that I can say is that the coin is going higher. How high, we will see. So we're pretty close to an all-time high for Solana. Once we break that $200 level, to me, it's a no-brainer that we're going to 260, and after that is blue skies. So it's going to be price discovery, and then we will need to see how the coin will jump in price from level to level. Is it going to be by increments of $10? Is it going to be by increments of $50 or $5? We don't know. So we'll have to wait. But on the weekly chart, very easy to read. We have the trend line here that is following exactly the MA50 on the weekly chart. The MA200 is also aiming up to the right. The momentum clearly for Solana is up, up, up. So this coin has performed quite well. In the last year, more than 370%. Year to date, approximately 100%. In the last three to six months, between 30 and 40%. And the last week, a little above 20%. So be in the fast horses, it's important. I think Solana is the Ethereum of the previous cycle. I truly believe it. I have a lot of conviction on it. I have Solana tokens that I'm staking on Coinbase, by the way. So I'm getting roughly around 5% of rewards yearly. So depending on your bag, that already is a nice return and it compounds. So every time you receive fractions of coins every four or five days or something like that, it's getting 
it's added to your total amount and then you continue the ball rolling I'm planning to stay Solana for a really long time and accumulate 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 and do and look at the compound effect of that staking rewards in combination of price appreciation that we will see in the upcoming months we will see how big you it will get so the performance is there for Solana the blockchain is performing very well so congrats to those who believe in Solana added throughout the bear market here between 20 and 40 dollars if you were lucky to add in this region of 20 to 40 dollars or even 20 to 60 dollars congrats to all of you that was the way to go bear markets are made to accumulate coins and bull markets are made to reward those who accumulated during the bear market and this will repeat in the future to what extent we don't know but expect the same after this explosive period for crypto assets so now let's compare with ethereum ethereum has come alive recently the last week or so started moving but if you analyze the price of ethereum versus the all-time high solana is 30 percent from all-time high in ethereum it's still a little over 60 percent from all-time highs but it's moving so that's kind of good so in order to solana to catch up ethereum it really has to outperform it on the way up it's not gonna be easy especially now if ethereum moves quite a bit but if for whatever reason ethereum stalls then it will give solana a chance to catch up but the chart of ethereum is pretty straightforward we see the trend line of the ma200 so far price has been following that trend line and just in the last week we are moving away from the ma200 trying to break above the ma50 and if it does then we're going to accelerate in price appreciation for ethereum if not we'll come back down and continue upwards in potentially this trend line going up to the right so it's bullish for ethereum we will see in the upcoming weeks how fast it moves towards all-time highs in comparison with solana these three assets are the three biggest market caps out there bitcoin solana and ethereum they still have a lot of power on the crypto market but obviously solana is the contender here trying to catch up the big guys let's see how close it will get is it going to outperform both of them is it going to is it only just going to outperform ethereum or is bitcoin and ethereum going to outperform solana it's still an option we will see by the end of the year where we are and also by summer of 2025 how big these assets are where they are in the crypto market cap and hopefully for the three assets we are way higher stronger and with gains for all the investors so i hope you find some information in this video i think putting your money in fast horses and disruption is critical i have a little less faith in ethereum right now but for sure i have conviction in bitcoin and solana for 2024 and 2025.